Hey everybody, it's Crappy the Craftsman here, Regression Obsession. Well, I'm building my table. It's kind of hard to film, there ain't much room left up here once you put this thing in here. But you could, up here, the deal I have, my room is 12 foot that way, uh, but only 10 foot this way. There's not room to build a table up here except for this way. So I'm gonna, I fasten it to the wall. This is the way I built it. You could, if you have more room than me, you could mount legs on all four corners and uh, make them adjustable so you could level it up and all that. Uh, but I leveled all the way around the wall um, and then frame, just framed it in like you do a deck. And I bought some three quarter inch oak plywood. I was gonna use birch but I got a deal on the oak and then all the other trim I'm going to use is going to be oak. Um, a traditional table has rounded corners and all that fancy stuff. We're not going to have that. Um, this is just going to have a rail right here. Um, I'm going to have a padding on it. I've got a really nice, uh, unbelievably nice uh, layout for this. I can't wait to show you all when I get it all laid out. But anyway, this is the beginning stages. This is video number one. The next step is putting the plywood on. I'll get that done. And then I'll come back to you. Putting the plywood on is very easy. I'm just gonna lay it on there and screw it down. And the reason I'm screwing all this stuff together, I could shoot it together with my nail gun, is in case I ever need to move it because it's becoming a permanent part of the house. And as you can see, I'm up in a kind of an attic loft thing at the lake house. So I, I'm kind of limited for room, but I think I'm doing pretty good here to get me a 12 foot table. I mean, I'm gonna be able to come all the way down here. It's a pretty long shot all the way to the end of that. And I got me some new padding. I'm gonna try this out. I was gonna use this, uh, but here's what I got. It is a kind of a foamy vinyl type material. I'm, I'm, I'm anxious to try it and see what it, what it does. I'm gonna do that before I put the, the rails are actually gonna set on top of the, sorry about my crappy video in here. Crappy has some crappy video in. But we'll get more into the padding later. But anyway, if you wanna follow along with this process, this is video number one, framing stages of building a practice table. Very simple. It's not gonna be a work of art, but it's going to be nice. You'll see when we get her done. All right, crappy says, don't crap out. <laughs> 